he pointed out one thing in the cup, um, the clock tower about a furlong out, and he just said, if I can be have him wound up to be looking to get somewhere near the leaders at the clock tower, he was a, a good thing. They're ready. They're racing. And first out was Hazar's command from La Cotton Triumphal March away well from Bianco Lady Kiamare. Wider out, Mr. Jazz got away nicely and coming right from the outside. Combat looking for the lead and getting it and Hayai away well. They were followed by English Wonder and Mark Vogel behind them from Nostradamus. Then came Noble Heights, No Peer. Tajor Mio next from Amarant and well back in the field is Homemade and Kiwi is last. Onto the course proper, combat by three lengths now. Two in second placing, Bianco Lady from Laka Cot. One to Kiamara, Dittman's got over one off the fence, working towards the rails. Mr Jazz is at his girth and then Triumphal March, the inside from Mark Vogel. A link further back, just a dash, followed then by Noble Comet, a link to Hayai. On the outside, No Peer, followed then by Hazar's Command and then came Noble Heights. English one to the outside, followed by Nostradamus in that fifth punch with Veloso. Fountain Court next from Shea new three or four lengths to Shagamar then came Mevron boy behind it to Jour Mio homemade Amaranth and last of all Kiwi Kiwi giving them an enormous start at Chiquita Lodge we spotlight the horses Jimmy Cassidy tells his story well at, at the half mile it was as you say the crucial part of the race um, and at the time I was probably some 20 to 25 lengths from the leader um, but it was that crucial I couldn't ask my Kiwi to, to go forward um, because I was always thinking of uh, the good inside information from Eric Templeton about getting somewhere near them at the clock tower. Well, from the half mile to the clock tower, you've still got something like three, three and a half furlongs to run. So it was just a matter of playing the waiting game. Triumphal match, make a line of nearly five. Noble comment behind them as they turn for home and then Bianco Lady. No peer to the outside, just a dash to Jour Mio looking for a run. Kiyomare sprinted clear. At the 300, it's a length and a half to Noble Comment and Mr. Jazz the outside, then Triumphal March, Nostradamus. Kiyomare grabbed by Noble Comment and Mr. Jazz. Mr. Jazz, Noble Comment, Kiyomare clear. Veloso making some sort of a run and Kiwi late. It's going to be close here. Kiwi's going to beat them all with a mighty run. Kiwi swaps them on the line and Kiwi's won at a length and a half to Noble Comment. There are few horses that literally everyone is happy to see win. But this is one of them. Yet another great Kiwi in name and nationality.